All right, I'm trying a new camera angle device thing, so I don't know how this is going to look or turn out, but anyway, so it's all over the news lately that there has been a ban lifted for 3D printing guns, and now the uh, mainstream media and the left as well as the right are all up in arms or, you know kind of going crazy over these 3d printed guns and how this band was lifted on 3d printed guns or you know what the band was so some guy put out the blueprints for how to make these 3d printed guns with 3d printers um plastic molding 3d printers and there was a court order for him to take take it offline so that people couldn't get these blueprints for these 3d printed um guns but he went to court. He said that it was a violation of his First Amendment, and um, he won. So he, they were able to put the, the blueprints back online. Now, I personally don't see a real big issue with this. I mean, obviously, you're going to have kids printing guns. That's what the problem is. People think that kids are going to be printing guns, and terrorists are going to be able to print these guns and make these guns and all this other crazy stuff. But in reality, if terrorists want guns, they're going to get guns. If criminals want guns, they're going to get guns. This 3D printed gun is a single shot, you know, most of the time 22 caliber uh, plastic, kind of like a zip gun. Like back in the day, um, you know, people would craft zip guns out of like iron and find a firing pin and, you know, the whole nine yards. And, and, and it's people have been doing it for years since the birth of the firearm. I'm sure people have been making homemade firearms. I mean, the first firearms were homemade, right? So it's, it, I don't really see why this is a news story. Um, if people want to make them, they're going to make them, whether there's a ban lifted or not. If you have enough time on your hands and enough ingenuity to make a firing plastic 3D gun, more power to you, I suppose. I mean, that's, I don't see how that really affects people. You know, it's like, oh, they're untraceable, they're undetectable. Well, the bullets that are in the gun are metal. So they'll go off with metal detectors. So that doesn't really make sense unless they have plastic bullets. Um, I don't really see how that makes sense, that, that they're undetectable. Um, and uh, it's, it's a single shot. So it's not like there's going to be mass killings because of this single shot gun. And to be honest with you, if you're getting robbed and you have this little plastic single shot gun and you shoot the person that's robbing you, you probably just saved your life. You probably just saved your own life by having this 3D printed gun. So, I mean, I don't know. Maybe I'm just nuts, but I don't really see see what all the the hubbub is about. I don't see why everybody's making this a big deal. You know, it's a it's a file that's online. If you get the file and you download it into your 3D printer, if you can make it actually work, then have at it. I don't know. I just think it's just more distraction, more misinformation, and more theater brought on by our mainstream medias. Um, I can see why some people would be upset with it, but I don't think it's a it's a big deal. And I don't think it's as much of a big deal as people are making it up to be, you know. And then you know you have the right that's like, oh yeah, even Trump is against the 3D gun. Trump had said that it doesn't make sense to him, and he spoke with the NRA, and it doesn't make sense. And what I think Trump is saying is, he doesn't see how it makes sense that somebody can make a gun because trump is not very smart um you got to remember trump also thought that we have planes that are invisible and he's gonna have a space force and all this other weird stuff because he's not a very bright person so he's saying that it doesn't make sense to him how this could be possible in reality it's been possible for years way before 3d printers way before these things even you know came to be people have been making zip guns and all types of other guns um homemade potato guns It's like a rocket launcher. But um, anyway, it's not a big deal. Don't listen to the bullshit. There's not going to be mass killings because of these 3D printed friggin' little 22 caliber guns. Um, And don't get me wrong, 22 caliber can kill you. But it's not not what they're putting it out to be. Anyway, that's my story. It's my rant for the day. Peace.